Well, interesting, you should say, prefers the smaller arena, so we'll, yeah. we'll see. But uh, either way, the best country had whatever they need to. They're uh, watching intently. Edwina Tops Alexander, currently third in the championship race with this horse that she rode to the win in Miami, California. It was a much smaller arena then, but I think they can pretty well swing it in any nice. type of arena. I think this horse, you know, it's a bit like in racing, they say good horses go on any ground, on any going. Ooh. Interesting what Albert just said, you know, that adding the extra stride to the bicycle there made the distance that Edwina's just fell foul of there uh, more suitable for his horse. So many, one big similarity to snooker, show jumping. You've got to be thinking one or two fences ahead, planning ahead, because the fence you jump before influences how you jump the next one. I know she's had a fence down, but this course suits this man. It's always on the back foot and she's neat and careful. Not a great big long striding horse. I'm gonna jump another one around here, but still just the three clears. See those distances there suit her, but because it was so short there, she just lost a bit of pace off the ground. You know, that's the price they pay there if they're holding them off that front rail, which they've got to do because it's, it's just a shortish five, even for California. And then the danger is having the 160 wide back rail off it, as she just did. Well, finished on the eight there for uh, Edwina Thompson Alexander and California 75, so it just drops that fence in there now. Steve, we, we, we can see this one here. Why is this proving so influential so far? It's very, very big. Yeah. You know, but, but in terms of relation to the rest as well. Um, 